folks we've got a really fun unboxing for you today folks it's the our generation flying colors school desk which fits most 18 inch dolls i spotted this desk when we went to smith's yesterday and when I saw it, I instantly thought of Jilly. Look how cute she is sitting at the desk and how well proportioned it is for her. Because she's an orangutan and not a doll, her rare legs sort of are just up in the air and they don't sort of go down to the floor. But I just find that really cute. So I'll be using this desk to do stop motion with Jilly. I did some stop motion with Jilly at the seaside. Um, I'll put that a short stop motion at the end of this video if you folks haven't seen it. But I just love all the detailed miniaturization with this set. It just looks brilliant and everything just looks like a miniature version of the real thing. There's so much in this set, I'm going to have so much fun in stop motion. And there's even sort of miniature exercise books. So without further ado, I'm going to get this set open, which will mainly mean cutting these cable ties, which are holding the plastic on that keeps all this stuff in place. So we'll open these ones first. Got a little folder. <laughs> Scout's just woken up. Got some paper there. Little cloud paper pad. Got a clipboard that works. This is actually a full size sort of clip thing. We've got a sort of false bottle of glue and some nice star uh, stickers. Got a false calculator. We've got this little stapler. It sort of moves up and down like that, but it doesn't actually, it's not functioning. This couch's just woken up. <laughs> <laughs> We've got two pencils. I don't think these are actually functioning pencils. I'll just try them out, but I don't think they are. No, they're just plastic. Don't actually work. We've got a little biro. Top comes off. And this again, it's just plastic. It doesn't actually work. We've got a marker pen. Top comes off. And this again is just plastic, it doesn't work. And then, last but certainly not least in this part, is a lovely pencil case that's got a pair of scissors in. <laughs> oh, again, the, the scissors, you can move them like real scissors, but I wouldn't have thought they'd cut anything. <laughs> but they're cute. And now we've got the other half to open. So another folder and some more folders, some more stickers, two more false pens. Two more false pencils. This I like. So it's a ruler and uh, those look like centimetres, don't they? They do, yeah. But it actually says inches ah. because everything's shrunken down. So your centimetres at the top and below is supposed to be inches, but the inches are more sort of centimetre size. Interesting. Mm. Composition book. <laughs> oh, and it's all lined. That's lovely. 
And then we've got some lined paper with a margin. Loose sheets. It's already got um, <laughs> hole punched. So you can put it in a pile. Lovely. <laughs> That's really nice. I really like that. And then we've got two of these, tri what do you call these triangle things, Paul? Uh, set squares, I think. Set squares. And again, um, it, it's got centimetres, but they're not really centimetres. They're smaller than centimetres. We've got a really nice protractor. And um, that, that, that's like a functioning protractor because it's um, obviously got the degrees are correct on it, yeah, 90 degrees yeah. and 180 degrees. It's lovely. I really like that. That's so cute. I wasn't sure if the, if the eraser was going to be a, a, a real eraser, but it's not. It's plastic. But some of this stuff just looks so real. I know you were convinced. That it <laughs> I was, thought it was all real. <laughs> you thought it was all real and it was all going to be functioning. But no, that's plastic. These look like index cards to go in the folders. We've got a squishy apple. Yeah. Looks about the right size for Jilly. She can have an apple. Would have been better if it was banana, wouldn't it? Mm. <laughs> but an apple will do. We've got three crayons that are very realistic, but they are made of plastic. We've got a pencil sharpener, which again is remarkably realistic. You would just think that that was a real pencil, pencil sharpener, but it's not. There's no blade on there. It's just plastic. So again, it's not functioning, but it's cute. In stop motion, I could get Jelly to look like she's sharpening a pencil. <laughs> then we have a lovely spiral bound little book with hearts on the paper. I'm sure I'll be getting Jilly to, to draw a little picture on these. And the final accessory is this sellotape dispenser okay. and the, the tape actually will pull off isn't that brilliant <laughs> so that is a fully functioning tape dispenser this pencil case is great you can fit in all of the pens all of the pencils all of the crayons the eraser the pencil sharpener, the scissors, and even the protractor and the triangular things and the ruler all fits in. It's great. So now let's take a look at the desk. This is such a lovely desk. It's all made of plastic, though it gives the illusion of having metal parts. The seat is gorgeous. It even has like the texture that a real plastic chair has. The desk has got like this ridge in so you can put the pencils in and the pens. And it's got an opening lid so you can put everything inside. So, Jilly looks like she's going to have a lot of fun with this. As I say, folks, I'll be doing a stop motion um, with Jilly, doing various things, various projects, sat at a desk. I'll put that little stop motion of Jilly at the seaside on, on now at the end of this video. So that's it for this unboxing, folks. Hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching as always and see you next time.